Yeah. And with this, I officially start my, you could call it my third season with the uh, anime reviews. And as you've seen, uh, I started in, let me see, that must be spring. Yeah, spring 2015 with the uh, written reviews. But I found out that it would have been, let's say it like this, if I had done video reviews there, it would have been like, I would have watched more anime there because it took a long time to write the um, reviews. So yeah, it's easier to talk about it. Uh, there's of course certain things like Free Rush, which is a comparison that I kind of can't do in a video. And yeah, you know, you have seen the previous season. You may joined in my previous season, which was summer. And now I begin fall with uh, Miss Monochrome. I hope to do better there. And with better, I mean like having it out on the day it airs, um, or at least very close to it. Not uh, like, you know, maybe having like a week or two uh, delay on it. But yeah, with that said, let's talk about Miss Monochrome's third episode. It is a really interesting one because, um, yeah, it, it basically it starts with them being on Mount Fuji, uh, basically praying for um, what you call success with the, her album and tour. So yeah, and during that, she uh, Miss Monochrome's uh, meditation enters in the state where she basically like have a I think she called it epitome. She basically got a realization that she, um, her concert to uh, make that a success, she needed a DJ because if she was to, you know, like uh, it, uh, run out of battery and then vanish, that they need someone to, you know, like keep the the the, the people what's called. I would say crew. That's not the correct term, basically, the, in Danish it's publicum, uh, uh, or, yeah. Yeah, they're basically pumped while she's getting changed, uh, battery and reappears, so yeah. And that leads to some really strange situations like Caramel, um, the, the idol dancer group, uh, basically doing some really strange thing and Mane, yeah, he's called Mane, uh, the manager uh, of the store Miss Monochrome works at. He traded in his man card by doing a ballerina move. And yes, I know that there's guys who does that, but you can be a guy and do that. You can't. It's just like uh, being with in uh, Just Vilma Dance, which is a Danish program. It's it's not something you can do and be a man. But yeah, let's say like this, neither of those uh, suffice. So they are like out uh, with uh, what she calls the um, Yayoi, uh, basically driving with her, uh, searching for one. And while they are fueling up, they find the DJ. So yeah, and I must say <laughs> that the, it seems like the anime budget for this uh, short gets a little higher because I can see some small improvements like uh, the frames is uh, like you know there's some small side frames with the faces you know like yeah it let me say this is, seems to be an improvement it could just be me but yeah I'm saying I really really enjoy this and Oh man, I'm looking forward to reviewing more like Hackadoll. I hope Hackadoll can live up to it or Heavy Objects or the other one that is out. But before I go uh, off topic and start talking about shows I'm really looking forward to, like I think it's Valkyria Mermaid Drive. Oh yeah, I need some Yuri. I need some fan service. I can't survive without that. <laughs> Oh man, but yeah, as 
as I said before I go off topic too much, I will say that I will see you in the next review, which will be Hackadoll, which hopefully will be up soon. Uh, I will uh, be uploading this and uh, getting put a picture on the other one, the correct picture, and then sharing it uh, to the anime review. Uh, tap on my Google Plus, and then uh, I will be getting straight back into uh, watching uh, Hackadoll. Then I will go. Um, I, I, I'm a little. If I want to do heavy object first or Lance Masquerade. But we will see to that time. And everyone, have a good day, good night, wherever you are. Cheers, guys.